So today guys, we are at an abandoned ski resort in uh, Berkshires of Mass. I'll let you know a little more about this place in the video, but let's go check it out. Blown out doors on this, uh, there's been a room you could write at this place. Little bathroom in there. Oh, what? I don't think you can get up there, but they have like a loft area. That's cool. Somebody definitely smashed some windows here. That looks like a fun trail to drive up with my Jeep. How much left in here? This was under the old ski lifts. <laughs> what do you think this this little thing is? A little sauna room or something? But yeah, a little some sort of little sauna sarner thing. Old, old dressers in here, microwave. Car bumper, you know, usual stuff at a ski resort. Control booth in here. Up on the catwalk now for this uh, ski lift. Hope it doesn't fall on me. The old motor they used to run it. What is this thing? Made in Germany. Probably an old diesel motor. It's only slightly sketchy up here. Still got the key left in it. Imagine if that started up. Pretty cool. So this place was once a well-known ski area in New England. Operated 1934-1935 ski season was its first season. They offered night skiing and some tickets were sale donated to the WW World War II efforts. That's cool. Oh. What are we got in here? I wonder if this was a staff area?
And Johnny Cash filmed a made-for-TV movie here in 1970. A sweet room to stay in. Get a view of the lifts. That's cool. In 1975, Ted Kennedy took his family here. Interesting. I gotta get my light out. It's dark in here. Not much in this room. This would have been a sweet, sweet, sweet. <laughs> this, uh, whoa. Look at all the tubes in here. Wow. Definitely their uh, maintenance garage. In 1949, the owners passed away, leaving the ski area in a limbo sort of state. But then in 1965, it opened back up with five trails and an 850 foot drop. Look at this old Arctic cat. Sorry about that, my gimbal thing is screwing up. It's not like there's water, these grates we're sitting on, they go down pretty far. It's not like there's running water or something under us. So many tubes though. So this was the uh, kids' play area, I guess. Those are pretty cool lights. And this thing which people used to buy TVs to put on this TV. That's an old, old thing right there. Nice, nice half door. Ah, dark in here. Oh, that's cool. Nice waterfall back there. Big old, big old play area for the kids. Nineteen ninety brought challenges for this place with area competition at other ski resorts and it closed in nineteen ninety nine. Two thousand four it sold to another family looking to build timeshares here. Two thousand twelve 
it was for sale again. Looks like they uh, they never completed the timeshares. Tell you what, not much left in here. This must have been the first building for timeshares that they built. And obviously, people destroyed it. We're not going up that staircase. <laughs> they definitely didn't want people in here. Uh, and they definitely didn't succeed. These were cheaply made though. Vinyl siding, vinyl floor, Carpet, cheaply, cheap looking cabinets. Yeesh. Cheaply, cheaply, cheap low. But I wonder, no one must have stayed here though. Maybe. There's some clothes. I don't think anyone stayed here though. Fiberglass tub. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Build on the cheap. Yeah, the doors weren't even. No one stayed here. No doors were installed. Great. Great looking timeshare. Yeah, either the heating system was never installed or it was ripped out. Uh, I think it was ripped out. Another bathroom. No cabinet. Another fiberglass shower. Hey, but at least they've got textured walls. Oh yeah, they didn't even finish. This one's a little more finished, I guess. You know, it's ironic. It's getting pregnant on a pull-out couch. Someone brought a dirt bike through here. Cute little kitchen in, I guess. I mean, if you're just coming to spend the weekend to go skiing, it's, it's nice enough. Sprinkler room. Hot water tanks. All the heat. Or no, that's, that's all for the hot water. same thing. I'm gonna go upstairs and check out what's up there. Alright, well, we're up on the third floor. Because there ain't anything to look at on the second floor. And it's looking like there is nothing to look at on this floor. Mechanical room. Not finished. They're either almost done with this place or they got done and then backed everything out. Yeah, these just look all the same. 
All right, guys. Well, that's my video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. We got to look at an old relic and be out in nature. At least it's not that cold out. You guys have a good one. Join me on the next one. Peace.